Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I am going to start off for the really first session of the District Tutorial Series. In this tutorial, we will dive into the fundamental of important data and tool in this video. I will guide you through the process step by step showing you how to effectively import data like it with the care environment. Whether you are a beginner or looking to refine your skills, this will provide you with the essential knowledge you need to get started. Let's get into it. So, first of all, we will create a folder named Urban Pet Short Urban. Switch link. The name. Urban Pet Short Urban. Switch link. The name. Where we will save our clinic data. This will Help us keep everything organized and easily accessible for future session. Next step, we will open the desktop program. However, as I mentioned in a previous video on how to install desktop software, it is important to follow a specific sequence before running the program. You must first open the RLM file and keep it running by minimizing it. Uh, we have two ways to open the RLM file. Open file location, select RLM. This step is crucial for the software to function correctly only after I show that the RLM file is running short. We proceed to click on the shortcut to open the result program. I will minimize it. Now I will click on the test field. Once this is open, the first thing you should do is save your work. For this, Opening to now it takes a time depending on your PC specification. So so first of all go to the File menu and select the save as option. It is good practice to name your project file clearly, so we will name this one with Open there to show it for sketch day for sales. Then we will save it in the open bit shorter sketch link trading folder. Create it earlier. This ensures that all your work is saved in an organized manner and can be easily retrieved. In following this step, you will set up the structural requirement for our training session, showing that all data and progresses are systematically saved and dashed. Now we are going to import DMXF file. DMXF file is used for photography and some type of block. In this case, we are going for photography. So click on click. On import, select CAD file and a four folder of the Excel file. We have to go the Excel file. Open, select OK. You can see that this file have two 
things. One is geometry and the other is topo. Like, okay. This is our topography lines. You can select one or all topolines. lines. You can do color change, line size to these lines. Next thing is to create a layer and you name it Photo dropping and make sure to activate the layer. The main reason of activation of this layer is to manipulate this line with what we require. Now, stay tuned for our next video where we will demonstrate how to create 3D model from this line. Don't miss it. Thank you.